Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you for a track review, and this is for uh, Ed Sheeran and Travis Scott track review, Antisocial. So I'm going to talk about what I listened to, and let you know my thoughts on this track. Uh, so let's dive into this review. Sorry if I... I'm used to saying, uh, I'm gonna let you know what I listen to and let you know my thoughts on it or whatever I say, but I kind of screwed up there, so I apologize for that. Now to talk about this track. This track is, uh, not too bad. Um, there are some moments in the song that don't feel like it works. It's pretty short of a song. It's only like 2 minutes and 41 seconds. So it's not really that long. Um, I like how Ed Sheeran's collab collaborating with these famous artists and for his new project. It's actually almost every song on here, well, yeah, I believe every song on here has a featured artist on his new record. And I think my favorite one might be Remember the Name. I never heard it yet. I will probably hear it tomorrow when the album gets released. But yeah, Remember the Name I think will probably be a really good track with Eminem and 50 Cent. So... If it's Eminem and 50 Cent, you know that this song's gonna be lit. And it's gonna be good. But this song, however, was... Mm, it wasn't bad. I didn't hate it that much. It, I know they're probably gonna make a music video for it, so... I don't know how the music video's gonna turn out. I won't know till I see it on Friday, because it said something about on YouTube Friday, and it showed antisocial afterwards, but this track had a good pacing of the melody, and a lot of interesting melodic sounds to it, or I think melodic sounds, I'm not sure. But I enjoyed it for what it was. Um, it wasn't half bad. It's not my favorite track, but I don't hate it that much. I think it's not bad. So out of 5, I think this will probably deserve a 4.5 out of 5. This isn't a terrible track. It's just something about it just doesn't interest me that much and keeps me invested into really liking the song. Maybe it'll grow on me, I don't know. But I still think it's probably going to get a 4.5 out of 5. It's not a bad track. It's actually half decent. Or it's better than decent. It's just not bad. It didn't do a bad job. And Ed Sheeran's vocals in this were kind of felt like it was he was rapping and singing at the same time but eh, I can forgive that it it wasn't a bad track it it did all right comment below let me know what you guys thought of the new antisocial track if you've heard it by Ed Sheeran and Travis Scott and if you like this track review comment below and let me know your thoughts on it Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can to support the channel. Um, I found it. If you want to know where I found the track at, go to Cape Jams and look up number six collaborations project by Ed Sheeran. And it'll probably show a track list. The Zip album track list thing. And then you press on that. And then you scroll down a little and you'll see the whole track list. And it'll say antisocial and download. And you press the download button and it'll direct you to the 
uh, antisocial track, and that's where you can download it there. That's how I was able to listen to this track. Cape Jams has actually helped me out on finding new tracks. Although I was hoping the album would have dropped today, but it'll probably drop in the morning or something. Tomorrow morning or something. Well, it's just fine. But uh, at least I heard a new song by Ed Sheeran and Travis Scott as well. So thank you for watching this uh, track review. I will return to you Friday for number six collaborations project. Well, maybe tomorrow night if I come around to it. But mostly Friday is probably when I'll return to you for number six collaborations project album review by Ed Sheeran. And I'll probably do a few movie reviews Stubber and uh, Crawl, I think, are the movies that I'll be reviewing. And, yeah, uh, like I said, thank you. And tomorrow I will return to you for some 41's uh, 13 Voices album review. I'm sorry if I'm mashing up all the stuff I'm trying to say in the end of this video. I'm just trying to make a good video. So you guys understand what I thought of this track too. Uh, but thank you for watching this review. Like I said. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in my next video.